Hi, it's Philip Byrne for phonescoop.com, and here I'm looking at Move Music, which is a new download music service from Cricket, and we're showing it now on the Samsung Suede. So, um, so this is the Samsung Suede, and we had talked to you about how we, we've deeply integrated the music service into the phone, and uh, the, the, biggest, the biggest feature of that integration is the dedicated music key. So wherever you are uh, in the phone, you can hit this button, and it's always going to get you to the service. Um, and so now we're in the service. And, um, let me just take you right into it. My Music is really where you manage all of the downloads. This is where you listen to the music and get to do all kinds of things that uh, you'll see are, are very new. And you know, we have it broken down by songs, by albums, by artists. Uh, we can go and look at my collection here, and uh, we have. Let's just go look at some some Van Halen, and uh, let's just listen to some Jump, and the music plays. And of course, there's uh, Bluetooth uh, in the phone, so you can connect to virtually any other stereo and a lot of people ask about oh can I put it on other platforms and you know, we think about the ability with Bluetooth or audio cables you can connect to you know to any stereo so um, we're listening to the song and we give you some tools um, first is the rings button up here so let's let's hit that and you'll have the ability to make a ringtone or ring back tone and I'm gonna hit ringtone and it brings you to a ringtone cutter and uh, you can set the starting point and the introduction of this song in particular actually is really cool, so let's stick with that. And then you can set the duration, 30 seconds, 10 seconds, whatever you want, and, uh, and just hit Create. And because um, the service is integrated with the contacts, you can actually go and say, okay, you know, when, when Jeff calls me, I want, I want this, this, uh, this song to go. It's appropriate. He expects me to jump when he calls. So, uh, so I'm going to set that as my default <coughs> ringtone. <laughs> And there, just like that, I created a ringtone. And, uh, you know, that right there doesn't exist on any mobile music service, and of course, any, any PC-based music service. So I'm going to hit the music button again, brings me right back to the song, so you can see how that music button allows you to navigate the, the service very quickly. So the music button, does it take you back to the last screen you were looking at, or does it take you to the now playing screen? It does screen? two things. If you hold it down, it always brings you to the home screen. Okay. So no matter where you're on the phone, you hold it down, it'll bring you to that. Or if you just touch it, It'll bring you, I actually didn't touch it. If you just touch it, it brings you to the, the play screen. Mm -hmm. And that's it, home screen, play screen, home screen, play screen. Um, <clears throat> so the second um, innovation from a feature standpoint is the shout button up here. So using um, text message technology, and we're deeply integrated with the SMS client on the phone, hit shout. And uh, Move Music, of course, is a community of friends, and I'll show you that in, in just a minute, but I'm gonna go in and go look at my my Move Music friends, and I'm gonna go select uh, him. Jeff, do you have your Toy CES phone? Hit Add, hit Done, and of course, this is text message technology, so I can actually write something like, you know, hey, you know, check out this song, and hit Shout. And just like that, um, I'm sending this song, and if I want, I can even send this album, or I can even send a playlist that I made, and, and Jeff's going to get it on his phone. And uh, you know, in a, in a few seconds, he's going to be able to um, uh, get that shout and download that song, and because it's unlimited music, of course, he doesn't have to pay anything. And so here, it just showed up on his phone. And there he is, he's going to select the track. Ooh. And there it is, Jump from Van Halen. And he's already downloaded that song, so he can just play it rather than download it. But in this case, um, you can just download. So it's a very, very uh, powerful sharing feature. How would those messages look to someone who's not using a Move-enabled phone? It would just come in as a regular text message. Uh -huh. And, and uh, we don't have an example of that yet. Uh, but it basically would say, uh, I, I'm... I'm listening to uh, Jump from Van Halen on Cricket Smooth Music. Sure. Something, something of that nature. And then um, finally, there's playlisting. Now, playlisting is not anything new. We've been doing that for, for years now with digital music services. But the way that we do it here is very elegant. Let's say that I do want to actually add this to an existing playlist or, or create a new one, let's say. And I can go and name that whatever I want, done. And just like that, I created a playlist. Mm. No, you know, when you think of all of the music services out there, the, the, the conventional thinking is that you need to do a lot of this stuff on your computer. And the way that we've designed it here, you just don't ever need a computer to do that, as you can see. And so that's my music.
And so let me take you into Get Music. And Get Music is the store. This is where you go and access the millions of songs that we have and um, search for the artists that you like. You can go into the search function and um, we can go and type in, you know, let's, let's say, um, let's go look for maybe Michael Jackson. He's always a he's always a favorite, and we'll just put Michael Jack in just uh, so it has so to show you the intelligence of the search engine. It you know just so you don't have to type out artists in completion. There it is. It found Michael Jackson, and it's going to load Michael Jackson's entire catalog. And uh, you know if you really like Michael Jackson, you can literally take his entire catalog. Of course, we're not going to do that right now, but. Uh, I can also go in and explore his albums. And what do we have here? What's what's a good one? Michael Jackson, uh, Essential Michael Jackson. That's always a good one. And so it's going to load up his album. And um, and by hitting the download button, you can go and select, of course, the entire album if you want it, or you can go. And multi-select. Uh, I'm not a fan of ABC, but let's see. Where are some songs I like on here? Enjoy Yourself and and Rock and Robin. Let's just say we want those. Done. And now the music will start downloading uh, to my phone. And as you'll see, as indicated by these arrows here, the music is downloading. And right now we're at CES, and you know downloads are usually Oh, in the in the twenty second range, give or give or take five seconds. Uh, but you know, just due to where we are right now, actually that song just downloaded in about eight seconds. So Rock and Robin, play, and now I'm playing Rock and Robin. So you saw about an eight second download, and now I'm playing that song. Just, you know, down here I'll take you quickly through um, some really powerful discovery and sharing tools. My DJ, my DJ. We wanted our customers to constantly feel like they're getting new music. <clears throat> and sometimes it takes some work to do that, it takes time. Well, <clears throat> uh, this tool, let's say uh, you like electronic music. It's gonna, we're gonna have, just fill this thing with pre-programmed playlists of all different subgenres of electronic or country or rock. And here, as you can see, we have a bunch. Retro disco, dance, Jeff likes retro disco, so I'm gonna go in <clears throat> and get him some of this. And I just hit the subscribe button. And all that music is going to fill up on my phone. And as I listen to it, it'll, con it'll continually update it. So I'll, I'll never have a tired playlist. I'll never mm. have an old list. You know, the music drought we all face with our, our, our typical music services won't happen with this. <clears throat> so it'll update in the background? Like, you don't have to do anything now? It'll just keep refreshing that playlist? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And always get pushed to your phone over the air. <clears throat> over the air, old, and it's download, too. It's not streaming. Mm-hmm. So you can listen to it anytime offline. Then there's Get Social, and Get Social is uh, is all the Move Music users in in sort of a community, and we break it into two things: into friends and to neighbors. And neighbors are people in the network that you don't know that are in your area uh, and have similar music tastes. And then there's friends, uh, and these are people that I know or I met through the service because we have so much music, uh, similar music tastes. And, and, you know, when you think about how people discover music, let's go look at Jeff's profile. When you think about how people discover music over, over the years, over the decades, it's always been through friends, through people. And so we really take that concept to the next level and, and bring an immediacy to it. <clears throat> so I'm looking at Jeff's profile, and I can look at his music, his shouts, his friends. Uh, but let's go look at his music. And it's going to show the top ten songs he's listening to. It's going to show his unique songs, the songs we have in common. Let's go look at the top ten songs. And so Jeff is, is listening to uh, Ben Folds, Coldplay, R. Kelly, Billy Joel. Let's go check out Ben Folds. And I'm going to just go download that song. And so through, through my friends, I just, um, I just found a new song. And as you can see, it's downloading here. And uh, in a few seconds, I just discovered this friend through my song, and I'll be able to listen to it. Sounds and that's great. and that's Move Music. All right, thank you very much. Thank you.